We are doing something today that is long overdue. Right, Lily? Mm -hmm. Elaine is helping me clean in the background back there. <laughs> so we've done Logan's tonight. We've done Gavin's tonight. Yep. I did Christian the other day. But it is time for you to get a haircut. Let's see this baby here. We haven't even brushed it. And this is how long it is. Woo! Look at that. It almost touches the bench because it's so long. Even in the shower, or when I, um, I hate when this happens. I'm trying to shampoo my hair and I like doing this. Yeah. Or if I'm washing out my hair, I'm doing this. And then it's like that. Yeah, well, when your hair gets wet, it will get longer. So I'm sure it is really long in the shower. Okay, so what are we going to do today? What do you want? Do you want something drastic? Should I cut it to your shoulders? All the dead ends. Just all the dead ends? Okay. Which is like... Yeah, we'll probably have to take at least yeah. a few inches off. That much. Yeah. That's okay, so I'm going to go ahead and cut it, and then we'll show you when we're done. We're going to get it up to at least yeah. here. <laughs> yeah. All right, are you guys ready to see? There's the hair on the floor. Okay, she it's a little this. bit, a little bit. A little bit? That's a little bit, right? Okay, there she is. Let me see. Turn around for us. Ooh. I can't believe you actually let me cut that much off because, oh, she's in love with her long hair and so are we. But it really needed to look a little healthier than it did. Yeah. So it looks so much better. Can you see it in the mirror? Did you look? Yes, I can see. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, now you have to go show everybody else because I'm sure they'll be like, you actually cut it? <laughs> That's a lot, Lily. You look like Izzy, but longer hair. Once That's true. That's true. You, you do. Like you guys used to get um, confused. People used to get confused between the two of you. No, imagine we get confused ourselves. <laughs> You're like, who am I? <laughs> am I easy or Lily? I decided that the kids got their hair cut yesterday and it is probably time that I get my hair cut too. <laughs> I can't even, I don't even remember the last time I cut it. I think it was in Texas, which we were in Tennessee and North Carolina for like at least six months. And we've been here for about a month and a half. So I know it's been a really long time since I've cut my hair. Um, I prefer to do it myself. Uh, I used to go to just like great clips or whatever, but um, this one time we found this way where we could um, put it in a ponytail. You like put it in a ponytail on your head here and you just pull it out and you cut it kind of like at an angle. And I, I liked how it looked after I did that and it was, like so easy and so I think I've decided that I'm gonna try doing that again. Sean ran um, about a couple hours away today to go get some car parts for the Acura that we bought. We were actually having a really hard time <laughs> finding parts for it and uh, he found some the other day and he's like okay I'm gonna go get them. Uh, he thinks the guy might have almost everything we need for it. So that was amazing. And uh, it was a really good deal too. So that's one thing I love is that if you just kind of keep looking, you'll eventually find what you're looking for. And usually I feel like we find it for a really good price. Okay, so today I am going to put my hair up here and um, you're gonna cut it with me. So I have my ponytails, my hair cutting scissors, um, I'm going to go ahead and put it on my head here in a ponytail. I've got to decide how long I want it. Let me see. I'm going to show you how long it is now. I'm going to see if it's long enough um, or if I cut off enough. And I'm going to have to look it up online because I'm not 100% sure. Um, you have talked about where I could donate to Locks of Love. I think that's what it's called. So I'm going to do that. If I think it has to be so long though. Um, Man, that was a snarl. Do you guys ever have to be careful? Do you have, I have an earring up here and I can't get it out. It's the lock is like locked shut and I cannot get that earring out anymore. <laughs> and it's probably gonna be cut off when I do when I finally take it out. But I just kind of leave it there. But I have to be careful sometimes when I brush my hair. 
Okay, I'm gonna put, um, I'm gonna show you how long my hair is now because it's down to my butt. And then um, I'm gonna put it up in my ponytail and then we'll decide how short to go. So here's my hair, let's see. Okay, there, Can you, do you see that? So it is all the way, and it is wet, so it's probably a little bit longer, down to here. <laughs> and that is my butt. So it has definitely gotten like super long. And um, I'm sure the ends are unhealthy, just like Lily's, you know, Lily's ends needed cut so bad. I'm sure mine are the same way. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it up in a ponytail. I have tried teaching my kids to put their hair up in a ponytail this way. And um, I think only one of them know how to do this. This is how I have put my hair in a ponytail since I was a kid. And I feel like it's so easy, but my kids have the hardest time doing this. And I'm not sure why, because I feel like it's super easy. I need to make sure I get it all the way forward on my head here that it has the right placement for cutting. I feel like my hair is extra snarly today. There we are, I have it up. I think I got all the bumps out. Well, there might be a few bumps. I think that might be okay though. And let's make sure this is brushed out here. So, this is how long it is. Ooh, down to my chest. And I have it in the front like this. Okay, now we need to decide how long, um, how long or short I want it to be. And I know my hair grows so fast, so I feel like the shorter probably the better, although I do not like short hair. I like my hair to be long. Um, and doing it this way, uh, you get you end up getting some layers. So, and I love layers in my hair, um, just real long layers, and that's what this does. So, I'm thinking, like maybe here. I want to make sure I go short enough, but not too short. And if you ever do this, make sure you watch your angle that you cut at. Uh, the last time I did it, I cut at a really big angle because I wanted to make sure that I had enough length. But what I ended up getting was just a little tiny bit of hair that was really long and it looked funny. So um, don't go so drastic on the angle. I'm thinking maybe. about here and of course I'll have to cut above my ponytail oops I want to make sure that I've got the hair the right way for cutting I sure hope this turns out <laughs> Oh boy, the crazy things I do sometimes. Let's see. Oh, man, I feel like my hair would be really short there, so let's go down a little farther. Oh, what do you think? You think that looks good? You know, I'll have to cut here. I think that's probably good. I always have to think about it for a little bit, I feel like, because I don't want to make a mistake. All right. Okay, I guess this is it. Let's do it, huh? Last time I had Sean help me. My hair is, actually I had somebody tell me one time my hair is not thick, 
I just have a lot of it. I always thought my hair was really thick. All right, there it is. That was a lot of hair cut off. I think my hair is going to be pretty short, but we'll see because I feel like it's always longer than what you think. So we'll save that. We'll see if that is long enough and then let's see what my hair looks like. <laughs> it was short. Look at that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. First of all, it's going to feel so much better for summer and it's really, I mean, I do have a lot of layers. Ooh, look at, I have, it even frames my face here, which I love that. I love when that happens, the framing of the face. I always ask for that. <sighs> Guys, I think I might love it. It looks so much better. Uh, it looks so much healthier. It will definitely grow out for sure. I do still have some length on it there. It goes down to the middle of my back. And, okay, I'm gonna have to measure how much I cut off because that was a lot of hair, I think. And this, I think this might be just a little bit shorter than I would have, um, I would have cut it myself. I've got some really short ones in here. But those are just kind of like my bangs. Um, I think that will be fine. I usually like to be able to pulled up in a ponytail at night. So that might be hard, but my hair grows so fast, like so fast uh, that within a month, um, I, can't, I will probably be at least um, an inch longer than this, I bet. So anyways, okay, let me know what you think. Um, am I crazy? Cause um, I feel like sometimes I do crazy things. Uh, but I just, I, that's part of the fun of life, I feel like, is kind of being a little crazy. Um, I think we have to be a little crazy to have all the kids that we have um, and to <laughs> do what we do, but we absolutely love it. Now, I want to share with you that um, I think we're going to start selling some of our favorite products. Um, we learned about, I don't know really that much about TikTok. I'm not on there. Sean is on there. Um, I know a little like more about YouTube and YouTube shorts, but TikTok has like, it's called TikTok shop. And, um, we're going to sell some of our favorite products on TikTok shop. I've opened the shop. It is, uh, the Conley clan shop. Um, I wanted to have it different from our regular, like the Conley clan TikTok because apparently they like to shut stores down and do things and you have to like apply to get back on, I don't know, like crazy things I've heard. So I wanted it separate from that. So it's, so we have the Conley clan TikTok and we have the Conley clan shop TikTok and we have, we have not listed any products yet, but we are going to be getting some, um, of our favorite products that we love um, or like some unique things that are out there that we haven't quite seen yet like one of the things that I saw that I think I, I like fell in love with the second I saw it was a uh, brush like I have a brush I'll show you um, I have a brush that you can straighten your hair with so it looks like this but they have a brush and they have them like this and they have them in like those, uh, like the circle brushes. And it's also a hair dryer. And I was like, well, that is a genius idea. I haven't seen them before. I think the girls have seen them. I'm like, my gosh, that's a genius idea. I would love to have one of those to dry my hair while I'm brushing it because I love to brush my hair and straighten it. And so I, we're gonna get some of those and try them out and then see what we think. And then if we love them, we're gonna sell those. So the, the um, hair dryer brush, some detangling brushes that are our favorites. Um, what else? Oh, there is a curling iron straightener. So you turn a little button and, um, or you push a little button and it's a curling iron or you push the button the other way and it becomes a straightener. And Molly is so cool. So anyways, we are going to start selling products. We have to order them in, so it might be a month or two. Um, so we don't have anything out there yet, but 
Uh, I will let you guys know when we start getting these in so you guys can check out what we're selling and you guys might love them as much as we do because some of these things I felt like were really cool. So, okay, I am going to dry and style my hair and see if I still like it as much uh, after I do that. I have it dried and now I'm going to try to curl it um, I was debating whether I should straighten it or curl it, and I think I'm going to curl it. So, I will say that I think a little bit of it um, did get maybe a little too short, but that's okay. Um, I measured it. It was eight and a half inches, the ponytail, and that should be way plenty to donate. So, at least I lost my hair for a good cause and I can help out. And mine will grow back, so um, I don't, it's not that big of a deal to me. So, um, okay, I wanted to share with you, man, what I have been going through. Um, I have always, always, always had, you know, I think I'm gonna start with my longer pieces. I've always had a really hard time with um, my weight. And I was, I was, was kind of heavy in middle school, not heavy, but just heavier than I should have been. Uh, and then in high school, I lost it all, and I was actually pretty thin. And then just as I got older, I would, I would gain weight, and then, I could, then I'd lose it. Then I'd gain weight, and then I'd lose it. And that has been this continuous cycle for me. But as I'm getting older, and I think closer to menopause, I've been perimenopausal since I was like 35, which that's really young, I feel like. Um, but, um, and I'm sure with all the stress with Texas and the moves, you know, then going to Tennessee, then North Carolina, now back to Omaha, you know, traveling is hard anyways, but then traveling with um, such a big family is really hard. So I'm sure that plays a part but man, I have been having the worst time. As a matter of fact, I weigh more now than I did in Texas. And I've been trying to do like intermittent fasting and that doesn't seem to do anything. And I just, you know, when you hear all these different conflicting things like, um, just the other day I was watching a video that said, oh, you know, you should, you should have your, like, if, like PCOS is a thing. So I kind of wondered about that and they said, oh, well then you should have your biggest meal for breakfast, which, you know, we were always raised having our biggest meal for lunch. I mean, for dinner, sorry, for dinner, for supper, dinner. Uh, so trying to retrain yourself is hard, but then when you're doing intermittent fasting, I don't eat breakfast. <laughs> so I'm just like, oh my gosh, but I, I have got to figure something out. I thought about going to maybe a hormone clinic to see if they could figure something out for me. I know a lot of people will go to hormone clinics and uh, completely feel so brand new afterwards. So I am contemplating possibly doing that. I'm not sure. I just know that right now I am so miserable with my weight um, and so upset at myself. And I'm just trying to figure out what to do. Well, I am done styling it. And so one thing I noticed that this uh, haircut does or the way that I'm doing the haircut is it makes it your hair really top heavy. So I feel like this looks still really thick and then down here in the ends looks really thin. And um, I don't know that I love that. I know that I could divide my hair into two ponytails, one here and one here. I think that's how Emma cut her hair. And I might try that next time. Although um, taking off eight and a half inches was a lot of hair to take off. I didn't think that it was that much. Um, so next time I'll probably go in smaller increments, but I don't think it turned out too bad for cutting it myself. And um, I love the layers and I always think that the layers make it look so much better with all the volume and stuff to it. So it is definitely better than what I had because it was just getting so long and it was always in my way and just, ugh. So I am happy to have a fresh new haircut. I wanna share with you that um, 
<laughs> have you ever had something for like a really, really long time? You know, when I was a teenager, if you can believe it, I think I must have been like, I don't know, maybe 15 or something like that, which is a long time ago. My mom bought me a makeup case that I really wanted. And you know how your parents are always wondering like, are you really gonna use this? Well, mom, <laughs> I have gotten a ton of use out of this thing because I still have it. Look at that. Look at, you can tell it's all worn out. And they used to have these things called caboodles. And I used to have one of those, but this is kind of an adult version of the caboodle. So um, no judging because it is really messy in here. I've also had this makeup brush case for a very long time. You can tell it's all ripped and worn out. I like to use my things until I can't anymore. Uh, no sense in buying new when the old works. But here's all these like oh, the lipstick pockets and I have this underneath and this on top. And so I have been using this since I was about 15 years old and I still love it and I probably need to give it a good clean out. But um, mom, you definitely got your money's worth on this one. Okay, so yesterday we had to skip his birthday kind of because he was a little bit sick and he slept most of the day. So today we are doing cake, presents, and ice cream. Um, I made a, a chocolate caram. I, I made chocolate brownies with a, a homemade caramel topping. You wrote happy birthday on Happy B Day. Yeah. Because I couldn't write birthday. <laughs> <laughs> That's with chocolate chips. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Logie, are you ready? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Is that the good one or the bad one? I, I thought I brought the good one. The bad one away. The master at Myers. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday, dear Logan. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Ooh la la. Chinese chicken. Hi ya. Logan. 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 Good then, no. Christian. Okay, Christian. Christian, Christian, go ahead. Yay! Yay. Yay. Logan, you want to open up your presents? No, Logan, yeah. Okay, go ahead. I'm open. No, you're not. Game for Logan this time. Yeah. Okay, Logan, can you get it? Yeah. Woo! Is this the card? I thought it was. It's okay. Oh, yeah, you're right. We've got to open the card. Hello. Let's see what it says, John. Yeah. All right. There's a little birthday boy on the front. Okay. Now, you're two today. I hope your special day is full of love, giggles, and a lot of cake. Happy birthday, Logan. Love, Grandma Tammy and Papa Mark. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, this or the inside. Mom, Logan's opening it. That's cute. Okay, Logie. Logie. Oh, look it. Is that chalk? Are they Lincoln Logs? Oh, yeah, but foam. Oh, foam ones? Wait, are those? Uh, Yay! Good boy! <laughs> My gosh, oh. My nails can't even. Here, Jay, hand me that. I'll set it over here. Really not. Oh! As you guys oh, can't see. He's confused, Mom. <laughs> he's as confused. Why did you take it? My fingernails are so long and I can't even break it. Mom. I know. You're doing so me? good not chewing them. Hey! <laughs> you never have a problem with your I nails. Never They're chew like them. overly long. <laughs> yeah, I like sometimes like touch someone and I scratch them. Yeah, you're right. Well, okay, so this is from Grandma and Grandpa Schmidt. Yep. It's all just a lovely, beautiful card. Oh! oh. For a special, fun-filled yeah. day. Happy birthday. We love you, Grandpa and Grandma Schmidt. Nice. Have a very yeah. good day. What do you get? $25? Yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. Life. Okay, let's put it, we'll go put it in your envelope. Okay? okay <laughs> Thank you. What should we open another one? You want yeah. another one? Yeah. Here, let, let him open this. Okay. Mom, I can okay. mine out. We'll open one. Well, it's not your birthday. You, remember, you got your presents on your birthday, and now it's Logan's turn. Rip, rip, good boy. But I don't rip it up. You're gonna. I think you're gonna like some of what he gets. Yeah, he's. he's gonna, what is that? Betty, let's pull it out. That's what it looks like, right? Do you know what it is? A microphone. Yeah. Hello. 
<laughs> ready? Um, Dude, there's my neck. Set. Go! Woo! Oh. He's terrible. He's right here. Oh, yeah. This is perfect. Just take. Oh, yeah, I keep that part room. Really well. Yeah, there. <laughs> and then two row where a baby can't open it. Okay, I tried. You make it where a baby can't open it. Right here! Oh, it's oh, on the table! I got you to Ready? Oh, it is here. a girl! <laughs> oh, here, oh, let's God, put it. Girl. We'll open them later, dude. Oh, I'm just giving me it open. Okay, next one. Okay, this, oh. one. this one is my favorite. Okay, yeah. What is it? Don't! Oh. What is this one? <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> rip it, rip it, rip it! I know what this one is. I love this gift. This is probably my favorite. Really? I know what it is. It's funny. It's Elena picked it out. Really? Yeah. What is it then? <gasps> it's like, it looks That's like a remote. remote. No, it's like a chewy. It looks like the Roku remote. Yeah. It's a host it looks just like it. So don't oh, get them mixed up. Yeah, I'll say if you get them mixed up, I'll be fine. He loves to carry our Roku remotes around. So no, he has his own. Yeah, that's your remote. Okay. Oh, oh, what is that? Well, that's a remote for him to chew on. It's a it's a pretend one. Sure. You want it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you have to know uh, what it is. You don't know how to open it? How do you do this? How do you do this? Uh oh. What is it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Oh, Dada. Push it to you. The jaw just dropped. We're going to push it to you. Here we go. Do you remember that? Yeah. It's just like the one at the cabin. Yeah. Oh, the the That's what exactly we had at the cabin. I know, it's, it's the exact same one. Now, Christian loved taking what this from Chris, uh, Logan. Yeah, yes, I know he did. So, look at mine up I figured Logan would be okay sharing. But Logan, Logan actually loved that one too. Mm -hmm. And then Christian would steal it. Yes, he would. <laughs> no one can see Logan. No, wait, this one is from... This one's from Lily. You did pretty good, Lily. Yeah, I'd say you did good. I want that. He can open it easy, I was not going to open it. Lily, oh, Is it a hand me down? Yes. What is it? It's a new owl she got literally two days ago. I think ago. he got it for oh, him. Nice. He loves it. Look at Oh, wait, oh, maybe not. Yeah. <laughs> His evil laugh. <laughs> Why does this look small? Millie always does a good job, I feel like, giving gifts. Go, 